Major cuts coming to the only trauma hospital in North St. Louis County. Now, SSM Health DePaul is getting rid of a key service this fall. Good evening, I'm Brent Solomon, and Allred has the night off. Fire and EMS first learned the news earlier this week. New tonight, they're speaking with our Justina Coronel. She's live from the hospital in Bridgeton with Reaction. Justina. Yeah, Brent, so I spoke to leaders at Pattonville and Florissant Fire, and they tell me that they're worried about the loss because they believe this area is already underserved. Fire crews in North St. Louis County are on the move, and soon their usual routes will change courses. So they can handle any emergency that we would have. It was a great asset for us to have them in our district. SSM Health DePaul Hospital in Bridgeton serves as the only trauma center in North County. Just this week, the healthcare system announced a cut. And they announced to us that they were uh, dropping their uh, trauma designation as a level two trauma center in the area. They stated that it was the number of traumas they get a year, that it just did not have enough calls to their facility to substantiate the center being open. Leaders at both Pattonville and Florissant Fire say this will affect gunshot wound and stab wound victims. It also impacts drivers. Our number one call that we run is a motor vehicle accident. Uh, the blunt trauma from these car accidents can cause internal bleeding, which these patients need a trauma center to get that blood replenishment. Chief Medical Officer Mark Flouter with Fluorescent Fire worries about the time lost. The fact that we don't have that facility to which we can transport those patients adds minutes to a transport time that these patients may not have. From their stations, it takes Florissant and Pattonville Fire Protection Districts less than 10 minutes to get to DePaul. The closest level one trauma center from DePaul is Mercy Medical Center in Creve Core, which is a 13 minute drive. Other level one trauma centers include SLU Hospital with 27 minutes and Barnes Jewish Hospital, which is 24 minutes away. This causing crews to make changes to stay on course. We're gonna have to adjust Rather than just a simple load, go, and stabilize en route, we're going to have to look at, you know, more fluid volume using different drugs that are out there. Now, I'm told the Level 1 Center for the Stroke and STEMI Center will stay open even when these changes happen on September 10th. Fire and EMS say that they will continue preparing and adjusting in order to provide the best care possible. Reporting live, Justina Cornell, 5 on your side.